All right, you guys. Thank, uh, welcome. And today we have the 2020 uh, Sakura Miku figure here. I know it is 2022, but better late than never, as they say. Uh, I'm not too familiar with the Miku figures. I'm not going to lie. Uh, all I know is they're fucking cute. That's it. And I like shit that's cute. But, uh, yeah. Uh, this is from Taito Giant. Yeah. Uh, when it comes to this particular brand, I'm not too familiar with them. Uh, this is the first figure that I've had from this particular brand, to my knowledge. Maybe I have, I have other figures from the same brand and don't realize it. Uh, but for the sake of this video, we'll just say it's the first time. But anyways, let's go ahead and jump right into this. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Uh, okay. Okay, there we go. I prefer cutting the tape and not the box. Not that the, not that the condition of the box determines the value of the figure. I don't know. Uh, I collect Transformers, so like... It does affect the value, but since this isn't a transformer, and she's not one of those anime girls that transforms into vehicles, to my knowledge, uh, there's an anime like that. I'm not too familiar with what it is or what it's called, but uh, I can assume Miku isn't one of those. Um, but anyways, go ahead and take these out. Just like any figure, it's in at least three pieces. The stand, obviously. Actually, this one's transparent and... Hold up, I got it. Oof. Okay, there we go. Oh, man. Oh, wait, I had it upside down, I think. There we go. Yeah, Kite... No, Taito Corp. There we go. I'm not sure if you can see it. Um, I'm not sure if having my finger there actually helps. But it says made in China. Uh, who the art was by? Actually, I think it should tell us on the box itself. Um, doesn't. I know on the side it should tell you who the art is by, but I guess for this particular one it doesn't. Okay. Oh, I was wrong. Okay, so it is in four pieces, I guess. Uh, to an extent, I'm still right, because the figure itself comes in three. And, um... Hmm. Let's see. So... I'm not going to put her on the stand just yet. I believe... Oh, man. Wait. Okay, I think I got it. Because the thing about these is they don't come with instructions. So, like, it's hard to say for certain what goes where. Like, I wish... Wait, actually, hold up. It shows two. This one only has one. Okay, so this one goes over here. Perfect. Alright. This one over here. And I think it is just like the box. Right? I th I'd like to think so. Anyways. Alright, so... Uh, okay. I think it should be... Man, these do not make this easy. There we go. I think. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you have to put some force into it, but... That is the end product, and I'll get some footage of it on the rotating stand. Um, actually, me doing this doesn't do it any justice, but holy shit, this is... Oh, man, I love it. 
I actually really like that uh, fading in and out effect on her hair because let's face it when uh, you do uh, just regular art like this I mean sure it's easy to tell there but when it comes to the figures themselves they kind of cut corners and just color it all the same but here I'm actually really impressed with the attention to detail with the hair and then the actual cherry blossom flowers uh, being translucent than a regular solid plastic color actually is very impressive I'm not too like I said before I'm not too familiar with Hatsune Miku um, I see this on her uh, sleeve so I think that should be part of it or uh, it's on both my bad but yeah I mean I have two other Miku figures but none of them really have uh, these and actually I guess I'll put some footage of those on uh, to this video cause uh, fuck it but yeah honestly this is a good one to add to the collection if your local shop uh, has them they start to fall off a bit so I had to reattach it uh, definitely pick it up especially if you are a Miku fan I know for a fact that I will be picking these figures up uh, any chance I get. Well, not this one specifically, but like any other Miku figures that I happen to run across. But, yeah. Um, here we go. Yeah, some really cute shit here. Oh, shit. Okay. Not made to be uh, lifted up and rotated as such. But, yeah, still definitely would recommend pick it up, especially because, come on, these cute cherries right here. Like, come on. Honestly, I thought this was like a strawberry figure, but it turns out it's cherry. A friend of mine pointed out that this was a cherry blossom. And uh, now I can't help but agree. It makes a lot of sense now. But, um, anyways, uh, just another quick video. Um, yeah, just thanks for watching, and if you haven't already, be sure to like, subscribe, and to turn off the, turn on, not turn off, turn on the notification bell, uh, to get notified whenever your, uh, a new video gets uploaded, and if you have any, uh, suggestions as to what you'd like to see reviewed on this channel, uh, be sure to leave a comment down below, and aside from that, uh, what else can I say except, uh, just... Thanks again for watching and have a great rest of your day, but more importantly, just stay safe out there. All right.